Welcome to Quick 3D Tutorials Master Class about Lighting inside Arnold. So, uh, in this case, we want to talking about bouncing light or GI global illumination and so on. When the light coming inside the room is trying going one side up and one side down, as is going to repeat himself more in one time. So, uh, of course, we can using it by turn the GI on, but it is going to be expensive, and in the same time, by this way, we have a lot of control. Uh, so, from uh, for now, we have. I can just turn the light. We have some fill light. I need to hide these for now, and focusing only about the key light it coming where actually light light coming from, and here is going to. Uh, give us the effect inside the floor So we just turn the light we have here. We need to scaling it and uh, Of course find the kind of is not the exactly one, but is going to be work So we want it to be kind of like this direction So now when we have this one on we're going to show the other of course in the viewport it's not showing really good so we need to checking it inside the render and of course I need to select it and playing with my explosion to get the effect I'm looking for so we just put it maybe like five so it is like the light coming from here and going to affect our scene maybe 5.5 .5 or something like that. or maybe five it will be good and in the same time, we're going to reduce the noise from this light. But when it's going upward, as you can see, it's going to came back once again. So in this case, I have just creating another area light. I have placing a top of it, as you can see. And uh, we need to go back to the render once again, playing with the exposure. So you can see now by the 5 is going to give us a little bit like filling the, the area with the light. So something like 6. So I have a lot of control which light need to be have more power in the other by this one and of course the color. But in this case we don't focusing about the color. And the important thing is as you can see now we have getting like a shadow here. And that is because my light, if we're looking, is not exactly on this. So you need to be careful about these things also. So here we have the kind of uh, kind of the final result of the lighting. But we want also talking about the character lighting. So sometimes we want only light for our character and not the other things. So how we can affect only our character and not the other is going to be in the next video. And thank for watching.